People talk about me all the time and say, first pastor, first lady, whatever they call me. Don't, don't call me late to eat. <laughs> You're one of the most humble people that I know, but I tell them all the time, if you can't go through something, Amen. Huh? Amen. then you are going to go through everything. Y'all want to catch wow. me? Yes. 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 You're giving up too quick. Amen. You're impatient. Yes. God said that he created us to be a help meet to our husband. Amen. That means to help meet his needs. <laughs> now I don't need to get explicit And that's not the only need he has Come on, come on, come on Come on, come on That's it, come on Thank you, Jesus We were created to help So why are we so tired? We sick and tired all we're doing is prophesying illness to ourselves. That's it. That's it. That's it. <laughs> wow. Oh, no. Same you create, God created you to be a help me to your husband. So many people, now listen, I told y'all this ain't a message for y'all because I know everybody in here cooks a full meal, everybody wash clothes and do everything that a husband needs to be done, you know, rub his feet and rub his back and, you know, we do all of those things, right? Amen. So y'all tell that woman that ain't doing what she's supposed to do, that the Bible says you were created to help meet his needs.
Because see, I know y'all like what I'm saying, but it should not be so in the body of Christ and in the house of the living God. Amen. We have to, it's not easy all the time to love everybody. Hallelujah. But you got to love your neighbors even as yourself. We spend a lot of time loving ourselves, but we don't love nobody else. Help me suited to meet his needs. And if you don't have a husband, well, gotta release one tonight. <laughs> Hallelujah. But let me tell you about that. See, y'all don't worry about me. If y'all wanna come, y'all want some Bible study, y'all come to church. Come to Bible study because your pastor teaching in here. Amen. Amen. Listen to what I'm saying. It's okay to desire a husband. But are you desirable? Because he got to also desire you. Because the Bible says that a man that find a wife find a good thing and also obtain favor with the Lord. And see what that question was, what about me? God said, if he find you and obtain favor, then you have automatic favor because he already has it. Come on. Wake up next to a hag. 